Alabama's Senate candidates are making the final campaign pushes before tomorrow's special election. Republican Roy Moore gave a rare sit-down interview over the weekend. Democrat Doug Jones rallied his supporters campaigning with New Jersey Senator Cory Booker. The politically deep red state has not sent a Democrat to the U.S. Senate in 25 years. President Trump is endorsing Moore, who has repeatedly denied allegations of sexual misconduct. Whoever wins the election will significantly affect the president's legislative agenda in the new year. Manuel Bohorquez is outside the Alabama State House in Montgomery. Manuel, good morning. Good morning. Roy Moore holds a slight edge over Doug Jones in recent polls, but most say this race is simply too close to call in what's become an unlikely battleground state. With the election just 24 hours away, these campaigns are focusing on one thing, turnout. When you think you can't knock another door, just knock one more door. With just hours until voters head to the polls in Alabama, volunteers for Democrat Doug Jones are scrambling to rally support. Hey. Do you think anyone out there is undecided at this point? I think there are a lot of Republicans that don't know what to do. President Trump has stepped up his support for Roy Moore. So get out and vote for Roy Moore. Holding a rally in Pensacola, Florida, just miles from the Alabama border. Roy is a conservative who helped me steer this country back on track. Recording a robocall urging voters to choose the GOP candidate. If Alabama elects liberal Democrat Doug Jones, all of our progress will be stopped cold. I couldn't vote for Roy Moore. Alabama's senior senator, Republican Richard Shelby, says he wrote in another Republican when he cast his ballot early. The state of Alabama deserves better. At least nine women have made allegations against Moore, including claims he tried dating them when they were teenagers and he was in his 30s. In a local TV interview on Sunday, Moore once again dismissed the allegations. I do not know them. I had no encounter with them. I never molested anyone. By show of hands, how many of you think all the women are being paid? Conservative Alabama voters speaking to Republican pollster Frank Luntz seemed unconvinced by the accusation. 40 years ago in Alabama, there's a lot of mamas and daddies that'd be thrilled that their 14-year-old was getting hit on by a district attorney. While Jones has held more than a half dozen public campaign events across the state in the past week, Moore has not appeared on the campaign trail since last Tuesday. He is scheduled to have a rally this evening where he will be joined by the president's former chief strategist, Steve Bannon. Nora? All right, Manuel, thank you.